Hey there everybody, I'm going to show you how to put your shoulder rest on your instrument, especially if you've never worked with one of these before. I'm hanging out at RMS, this is actually the band room, so um, those of you who are in ADO that um, may not have been in ADO last year, this is where you'll be. So here are, is an example of one of the shoulder rests that might come with your instrument. Um, some of them have the feet that are already flipped out, and some come like this, so they fit in your case a little bit easier. So I'm going to go ahead and take out this instrument. I'm going to take the feet and I'm going to flip them out. You might see there's a curve to it. You want the highest part of the curve to go under the chin rest section. So, highest part of the curve chin rest. So the way that it, let's see if I can do this so you can see it, it slips over on the one side, the instrument, then you're going to go down until you're able to get it around and slide it in. You kind of have to readjust a couple times just to get it to sew. And there you go. It's a lot easier to hold your instrument correctly with this type of shoulder rest than it was for the sponges that you may have used in the past. Um, what, sometimes they don't fit correctly. Um, they might be the wrong size. If that were the case, either it's too big and it's falling off or you can't quite get it to go over the curve of the instrument. There are little screws here. So if you unscrew, unscrew you are able to move this to a different spot. And you can readjust it. So there's lots of little um, adjustments that you can make to make it be just right and to make it be comfortable. As always, if you have questions, feel free to leave a message on Schoology or email me and I'd be happy to help you out. Bye.